Hello, Lily. Hi. Yeah. That's why her name isn't Backstrap, y'all. Because Lily is not for cooking. All right. I was thinking about something this morning, and and um. And the deal is this, people are saying, gosh, so many people are leaving the churches and uh, churches don't have the people in them that they used to have and some of them are even closing and things like that. Do you know, it's as simple as me putting out this corn for Lily. Now all the other deer come up, but two, but me and Duke are out here walking in the midst of it. So they're kind of off in the shadows here looking at us. But the point is even something wild, even something wild will come up and chance it if you put out some food. You know, you can call cows to the trough so many times and never put any food in there and they'll quit coming. And it's like that, call it oversimplified, but it's like that with churches. Listen, if they're not putting out some real food, and I mean, come on, come on, the same old, same old that we've been here in the last several decades, 50 years, you grow up in something and you come back to church and you hear the same message maybe brought with a few different words or something, but it's the same thing that you already know. If they can't bring something fresh, then you got to go find some place that will. Go find you a place that's putting out fresh food. And I'm telling you, then you'll see a few wild ones come in because the wild ones out there aren't accepting that old just, oh, I don't know, day old, no, decades old food that's molded and, and all. I mean, the gospel is the gospel, no matter what. But we've kept believers so ignorant because we think all we got to do is give out a salvation message Sunday after Sunday after Sunday, and they're going to keep coming back. You know, after 20, 30 years, I get this. I got it. I got it. Let's, let's, let's find out how to walk in this stuff. Ah, right, simple as that can be. But the answer to churches not having people, you start putting out some food, they'll come.